Hey, what's up guys? Philip Williams here, wheeljamsbeats.com. Hey, I wanna show this with you guys. I'm gonna try to keep this short. I say that every time, right? But I really am, I'm gonna try to keep this short. But I wanna give you guys a quick explanation concerning um, beat licensing and what that means, right? Now, when it comes to contracts and stuff, any of that can be created and wrote, written up by an attorney or somebody anybody could write up an agreement or a contract um but the way i way i have it on my site and many producers they do it different ways but what what you simply need to understand as an artist is that when you go to license and purchase a license from a producer whether it be me or anybody else that you you work with right make sure you read the agreement read the licensing agreement because that's exactly what it is it's licensing it's the creator of that music that instrumental is licensing you permission to use their music under certain criteria or under certain limitations so if you buy a basic lease for for that for example, then that lease is being licensed to you, the purchase, the purchaser, for a certain period of time, based on what that agreement is, based on what that like the level of that license is that the producer determines, right? Now, if you purchase exclusives, then exclusive doesn't mean ownership. It means you have purchased a exclusive license to utilize that music that the author the producer wrote right the producer the author of that work has the ownership not you you're purchasing a license to use it and you're it's exclusive license where you're able to utilize it and however you see fit but again it's based on the agreement based on what the the criteria are so understand when you're going to purchase beats, buy beats from other producers, understand what you're purchasing and understand that when you purchase exclusives, you're purchasing a license. You're not buying, taking ownership of other music unless the agreement is set to do so and you have a binding contract, contractual agreement, right? Excuse me, because after all, you're not the one who created the music. Second, let me let me add that this is a bonus. Whenever you write your lyrics, write your music, you automatically have copyright. You are the copied writer of that music. You have ownership of those lyrics, right? You own it. Same with a musician. When they create that music, they own that music. And so they can license out permission for people to use that music hey what's up baby tell everybody i said what's up tell hi them. hey so that's what that is right so i just want to help you guys with that kind of give you just um just a 411 kind of help you with that because i know there's a lot of confusion out there look i'm not an attorney i'm not a music attorney i have an attorney i have an attorney that that, that i'm able to call and 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 get them to draft documents for me right i'm not an attorney i'm just sharing information sharing with you what i know the things that i use every single day with my music and my business so hopefully this is value to you if you have any questions please post them in the comment box below like this post share it get the information out there because people need to understand what they're getting into they need to understand what they're getting um you know because a lot of cats they get upset because they don't really understand what they're actually purchasing and that just creates a whole bunch of unnecessary confusion in the marketplace. Um, and really, it's not necessary. So hopefully, this is helpful. I'm trying to help you guys uh, as you make um, decisions. You want to make um, um, educated decisions on what you get ready to do, especially when you're trying to move forward with your projects and move forward with your business. So I hope this helped. This is Philip Williams, wheeljamsbeats.com. Thanks for supporting. Thanks for watching the videos. Thanks for purchasing the beats. And uh, there's my baby, Gabrielle. She's hanging out with me. She just learned how to ride her bike today. Um, so we're hanging out. And uh, good job, girl. Good job.
Thank you. Yep. You should listen to him. He's smart. <laughs> Thanks, baby. All right. I'll see y'all on the next video. Take care. Bye.